What is up, everyone? Welcome back. I'm Machara Kirk, joined by Michael Booth. <laughs> hello, hello. And we are watching Gen V. Woo! So I actually have not seen a single trailer or anything for this, although I understand the premise. It's set in the boys' universe, mm -hmm. and it's a college. For superheroes, how fun. <laughs> Yeehaw, this yeah. can only go well, <laughs> so I'm well. sure. <laughs> <laughs> Having familiarity with the boys' universe, I'm sure this is going to be a delightful slice-of-life college TV show. So cute, so mm -hmm. lovely. Adorable. So sweet. <laughs> so, saying that, you guys, obviously, with it being in the world of the boys, you know there's going to be a lot of censoring and stuff going on. So, if you want to watch the entire episode along with us, obviously, the best way to do that is through our Patreon. Patreon or through memberships. Just be aware that you do need to have your own copy of the show. It's on Amazon Prime. For those of you on YouTube, thanks so much. Please subscribe, click the bell icon, all notifications, and upvote this video if you enjoy the content. All righty, here we go. First black man in the seven. Hey, girls, come look at this. No thanks, Daddy. No thanks, Daddy. This is history. Don't smile. Come on, you have to do it like Kendall. Oh. No, I'm using Lord Kelvin. That's the good one. Trains the most driven kid I've taught since Queen May. Mr. Krabs. That's the best one. Delete it. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. What's the matter? Period. Um, I'll be I'll be right back. Marie, you okay? Or a bad burrito. This is gonna be when her powers manifest. I was gonna say either powers manifest or something's wrong. Oh God, I'm scared. I'm genuinely <laughs> like really scared for what's about to happen. You good, girl? Period. Ah, yep. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Also a scary yeah. <laughs> time. I, I, I can only imagine. In any girl's life. You need help? Don't come in. I'm fine. What? No. Mom gets it. Yeah. <gasps> oh. oh! All right, cool, power's manifesting. Just break down the door. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Oh. Oh. Oh no! Oh whoa! Oh, that's not good. G close it up! Close it up, mom! Baby <laughs> whoa, that went from zero to sixty in no time flat. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh, oh god! No. Oh god! Oh boy! Big oof! Yeah. Dang, okay. That's rough. Ooh. Ouch. Oh, both hands. Fun. It just seems like a slightly inconvenient power to have. I time. mean, yeah, you know. It's like blood bending. Yeah, yeah, basically. Now, my question is does she re reproduce? <laughs> the blood she uses as fast as she gets rid of it? Or is there like, you know, yeah. one of her limiters is the fact that blood loss is very much a human condition. Yeah. Okay, uh, yep. Yeah, uh, all right. too much. That answers that question. Yeah, what's up? You're signing into your video call right now at 4 p.m. Always be 15 minutes early. Oh, is this when she gets it? Guess I'm just surprised. But I can go, right? I mean, it's a full ride, and I'm 18. Congratulations. Wouldn't be surprised if you ended up protecting a city one day. I think you meant to say first black woman in the seven. Well, I stand corrected. <laughs> it's good to have ambition. Mm-hmm. Where are the misfits? I want to see the misfits. I was going to say, look at that insane security system. Oh, gosh. It's time to test my shit against the toughest motherfucker here. What is this, prison? That's my gerbil, David Crusoe. And it's about to go down. Oh, she's oh my ready. gosh. All right, I understand now. Hey! You must be Marie! No, down here! Hi! Man, imagine going through life gerbil-sized. Uh, hi. Does she ever get bigger? I guess not. <laughs> nope. 
Oh, I've she does get bigger. I to meet you. Oh. oh, God, you're so pretty. <laughs> Thanks. You want to wake claw? It's nine in the morning. Ain't no laws when you're drinking claws. <laughs> so what are we doing here exactly? Dude, his workouts are practically the social event of the season. Who's? Golden boy. Is. Yeah, golden boy. Hi. Hello. All right. What's the game? I was going to say, yeah. It's huge. This is a superhero university. <laughs> Her face. Ooh. Ooh. Roasty toasty. Yeah, do you burn? Like. See what I mean? It's like a big, fiery sea cucumber. <laughs> oh, I see. It's not as censored as I thought it was. Jesus Christ. Who wants that kind of pressure? I do. <gasps> oh my god! Yeah! But you're in school. And you can be like that guy. What? Where is an adult? Oh. oh. Hey. Oh. Look at me. You did good. That's right, next time. Up. Thanks, man. Yeah. Thanks, man. You just ripped my arms off, but you chill. Oh. You're gonna see some shit right now. Mm-hmm. That is not, though. Yeah, you're gonna really regret <laughs> helping these guys. Calm down. Dang. Ooh. Ooh. Shit. Yeah. Agreed. Yeah. Oh, is this... He couldn't have come from this place. That looks super high. No, that's definitely where he came from. I'm not going back to the woods. Please. Yeah, oh, I guess... Don't yeah, leave me in Please, please, please! Oh, wow. Please! Godolkin is a safe space for you to thrive. Uh-huh. Wow, that was a great cut. Well, there's some sweet moves last night. I was coming up with your superhero name. You want to hear it? Bloody Marie. That's terrible. <laughs> that skinny kid. Have you... you seen him before? The way they dragged him off was just... F***ed, right? Yeah, he was out of control. Was he? Okay, Coagula. <laughs> I'll show you what I come up with. Tonight? Smooth. Yeah. Come on, he's cute. A uh, field trip. Off campus. Golden boy myself. A few others, you should come. Yeah, go. Out with you guys. I mean, that's how socializing works, right? Make friends like a normal human being. We'd be breaking curfew. If we get caught, we're not going to get caught. Thanks Knock for on the one. invite. Uh, but no. What? I can't afford the trouble. Oh, well, fair. she's going to be the golden child. And if she flunks out, like... Yeah. Try fighting building at 10. We change your mind. Okay, this is me changing your f***ing mind right now. She's on scholarship. She's got yeah, the... all sorts of reasons to not get caught. I think he has a girlfriend, right? Yes, and she's hot. Oh, my God. You're going to have a three-way. You're literally living my dream. <laughs> <laughs> I love her. I have anything to wear. Please borrow whatever you want from my closet. <gasps> okay. Oh my goodness. So, yeah. No, you didn't. Love you, Emma, but I don't know if your style is exactly Marie's. Oh my goodness. All right. Okay. I mean, All right. the, the outfit works. Yeah, it's cute. It worked. It's cute. Aww. That's why she was like. Don't people, leave the hate comments. Yeah. Come on. There's so many people out there that love you that don't leave comments. I'm scared. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't like where this is going. Yeah. I can't believe I'm at Seven Tower. Let me guess. You were six years old in a Maeve costume just dreaming about making this set. Now I do. I didn't even know I had powers until I was 12. Really? My parents gave me V as a baby, but it didn't hit till puberty. Yeah, they died. <laughs> yeah, really exciting. I'm sorry. I I'm lying. M my parents died. 
I don't know why I do that. He's not the guy to be telling this. I don't know. Well, maybe. He seems He's like... clearly got some stuff going on. That's uh, why I'm here. At this school. For my sister. Being a hero is, uh, it's not what you think. Mm. You know, if you're going to do this, make sure you do it for you. Believe me, little cricket. <laughs> I used to jerk <laughs> to when I was 14. That's sweet. <laughs> <laughs> you, sexy and small, hanging off my... Say yep. no, girl. Say no. Just no. Oh, you're, that's you're, rough. You're, you're better than this. No. <coughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Why are you doing this? I guess it's how she makes her powers work. No, but like... With the guy. Oh, oh, she gets smaller each time she does that. Oh, that's I wonder horrible. how she found out that that was the thing that. Yeah, right? It. I can't even imagine. Uh huh. Mmm, delicious chemicals. <laughs> now let's dance. What? Come on. I told you. Goodness. Yeah, she's cool. It might be a threesome tonight. Uh oh. You're not doing so hot. No, don't don't stop burning up. Oh, if you light up. Oh. Oh, there's the trees. The trees. Oh. Welcome back to the real world. How are you alone right now? Waiting for my boyfriend. Uh, how about? Heads, I stay. Tails, I leave. Mm. You're a soup. Or I'm just a very good magician. But soup sounds sexier. Let's go with that one. <laughs> He's smooth. If I can get this little birdie into his cup, will you agree to, at best, go home with me? And at worst, we hit the dance floor and have a good time. He's, he's very he's smooth. smooth. He's got the charisma. Oops. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, no. We need to get the f out of here now. You can get her blood back in. You can That's get her blood I back in. I was wondering, like, can she... Can you blood bend it back in? Yeah, put it back in. You can yeah. stop it. You have enough control to stop it now. Alive. See here all the cameras. Yeah, the clicking. camera's going off. She's Everybody's about to like go recording. Viral. Oh my gosh. She saved the girl's life. Okay, sure, you're the hero, but I'm the one who made you go. So in a very real way, I'm the hero. <laughs> Atta girl, Emma. Ah, uh, Marie Moreau, you saved that girl's life. Good for you. Sorry, I'm to tell you this, but you're being expelled. <sighs> yeah. Yep. Wait, I, I didn't. I, you. You can't kick me out. Oh, I'm so sorry. I really am. I, I And I like you for what it's worth. No. You're an orphan who murdered her parents, kiddo. I'm afraid you don't got much choice. Yeah. Where are you? Where are you? Oh. A sibling, perhaps? Yeah. Luke, please help me. Oh, so it's maybe his brother is yeah. in the whatever, in the lower um, levels Amira or wherever. Or whatever. The hell. Yeah. Yeah. Privileged kids. Oh. Oh sh shit. What? He fell asleep with a camel lit in his mouth and he burned himself. Yeah. For sure. Our secret. Yeah, cooked himself. Yeah. <laughs> sleeping with a cigarette in his mouth. Uh-huh, sure. 
Oh, yeah. Go now. Go. Woo. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, stop. What? No, keep running. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you see me running, you keep running. No. I'm Woo. Sorry. It's okay. No, he's Don't light do up. It. He's going to light up. Oh no. What's he doing? Oh no. Oh. Burn. Oh. Okay. Whoa! How do you even figure out you can do that? I guess if you have enough control over your powers, you know, like limiters and stuff like that, but jeez. Holy cow. Cue snazzy song at the end. Wow. Alrighty then. Despite tonight's incident, here's a look at what students can expect from this esteemed institution in this upcoming semester. Oh, this is like the... Yeah. You could be the first top-ranked freshman in history. For what? For fighting Golden Boy. Hashtag Black Girl Magic. <laughs> <laughs> Except I didn't fight him. But I found something. Let's see. Another fucking word about this. No tiny action hero shit. Got it. Get it. Got it. I love her. You have to stop him. I did rip person in half. <laughs> In my defense, he was a puppet at the time, so. <laughs> oh my All God. right. Wow. Okie dokie. Okay. I guess. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to the boys' universe, ladies and gentlemen. We've got it all. We've got blood. We've got gore. We've got overt acts of sexual violence. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> Damn! Oh my gosh, that was a lot. That was a, a lot, a lot for the first episode. I mean, it's really exciting, like k kind of setting up all the stuff, you know, like with uh, Marie, our uh -huh. lead character, uh -huh. who's got this trauma and yep. this like weird power and the secrets, which like we know Vought is super evil. Yeah, <laughs> so, big sus, big sus. Super big sus. Um, this has been kind of a fun premise. I like, they've really set it up as sort of a, Rather than like the action noir comedy of the original boys series, this is feeling more like the teen drama mystery. Yes. But like the it's like Riverdale, but if it wasn't like, you know, soap opera, -y, I guess. <laughs> You know, we've got yeah. we've got mystery, like what's happening in the woods? Why did Golden Boy go off the rails? Yeah. Like what else isn't Vought telling us? Because goodness knows nothing about their company is, is above board. No, absolutely not. And it's just like it just frustrated me so much as well, like watching Marie, you know, go out with these guys and then do this heroic act, meet her hero once right. again. And mm -hmm. then he's all like, so you're going to have to, you know, sacrifice, but basically take one for the team. Yeah, bite the and, bullet. Uh, and it just made me so angry because it's like, here she is, this underprivileged kid. She's just trying to make her way and she has these big dreams. And then, of course, the teachers are all like, well, you're the one who has to be sacrificed. Yep. And it sucks. And what sucks is that that's kind of the way of the world a lot mm -hmm. of the time. Unfortunately. Is that the, the people in power are the ones who, you know, they're going to take advantage of you and mess you up if you're not also, like, of the same status. And that just made me so upset. I'm like, oh, the injustice. And then... 
he dies. <laughs> and then he's he's dead. He's, he's been burnt to a crisp. Yeah. In a smoking accident. Yeah. Yeah, one hundred percent. Oh, I, I I was kind of expecting something to happen when um Golden Boy walked into his office again. Yeah. But I, I I didn't realize he was just they were gonna out and out kill him right no, off the bat. I thought it was gonna be like a a confrontation of some kind. Mm-hmm. And it's interesting because obviously we have so many questions now about uh Golden Boy, mm-hmm. right? And all we saw was this conversation with, I'm assuming it's got to be his younger brother or something. It, it has to be. Like, yeah, a younger brother, something like that. Family member yeah, exactly. saying, like, help me. And it's associated with the woods. And then he just straight out kills this guy. It's like, wait, well, what, what information did you have? How did it go from that? To that. Okay, I'm, I'm, I see this in, in two ways potentially going. And again, this is the first episode, so like, uh, I'm just firing blind here. Okay, it's his brother. His yep. brother has some sort of like mental dream projection powers and yes. stuff like that. Yeah. And both of them were maybe in the woods. And then Golden Boy got like mentally conditioned by Brinks or something like that yep. mm-hmm. to phase that out and be like the golden superhero. But then his brother was able to break through that facade and then he remembered everything and that's why he killed Brinks. Alternately, and a storyline I'd like to see, whoever that is in the forest isn't actually his brother and maybe of malicious intent. Ooh. Perhaps there's some sort of, um, I guess, like... Stranger Things esque Vecna like overarching mind control sort of thing that's um, maybe at play here. So I'm curious to see if Boy in the Woods turns out to be good or bad. Yeah, both are very interesting theories. The first one was the one that I was kind of going for, but right. yeah, the second one with the, with the malicious. May, may, mayhaps there is some prisoner in the forest who is uh, too powerful to be left out on their own, and they're slowly getting their feelers out into the rest to the school. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm very curious to just kind of see how this all plays out. Absolutely. And just kind of, yeah, the, the, the drama that we know from the boys, but playing out in this, like, I was going to say smaller scale, but it's it's still pretty big. Yeah. <laughs> it's, just, it's still a pretty grand scale. People's yeah. lives are on the line. Yeah. It's just like, but it's in university. Mm-hmm, so, mm-hmm. you know, it's yeah. just like a little bit more contained than, you know, the big stage that is the boys. I will say it's nice getting a look at like what adolescence and growing up with superpowers kind of feels yeah. like. Because, you know, a lot of the boys is focused on superheroes that are already in their fame or have missed out on their fame and like are living as adults. Yeah. Yeah. So it's um it's interesting to see. You know, puberty and growing up and college even is hard enough without superpowers. Yes. And so with it's just yeah. extra it's just extra hard. Yeah. Plus all of the different politics of like, you know, obviously it seems like the kids who are for lack of a better word, the chosen ones, yeah. like the top, mm-hmm. they seem to be quite privileged youngsters mm-hmm. who are able to like go out, get the drugs, yeah. party, and not care because they don't have to, you know? And so it's kind of interesting to see how, like, status plays into it as well. Yeah, I mean, a lot of good stuff, a lot of good stuff going on, but you got some of the stuff, though, man. The thing the thing with little Emily, I'm oh, pretty sure yeah. we weren't able to show it. Mm-hmm. I don't know if we showed it at all in It's Gross. Mm-hmm. You guys yeah. watched the episode. Oh, yeah. I could not. Oh. Oof. I feel so bad for her. I know. Poor Emma. It's like, oh yeah, Emma. That's right. I messed up her she's name. She's like best but character and she's already off to a rough start. But I, know. I know. I just feel so bad for her because it's like, girl, you didn't need to do that. He's got a weird fetish and you just leave. If you don't want to do that, like now you just feel bad about yourself. I, like, know, I think mm. I think a lot of it's tied to her own self-image because I mean, she's got this big YouTube channel and everything with that, with her going tiny. Yeah. That now she's like, well, this is my brand. And this is who people think I am. And like, it's it, it can be hard. And I mean, like the boys does a lot to talk about like branding versus the yeah. person and how it can be hard to separate or um, reconcile the two when you are a big name. So, I mean, she's got that whole YouTube following. And yeah. like, I think in a way she seems like she feels like the only way that she can be validated and have people like her is through her like little tiny character herself. I know. And I think it hurts because like I can see how in that situation at that age, 
she would be like, okay, yeah. I guess I'll do yeah. it. But I'm watching it and I'm feeling like a big sister and I'm like, no, don't do it. Love yourself. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, no. It's he's not, not worth it. He's not worth it. Mm-hmm. Come, we'll mm-hmm. have coffee, you know? We'll take care of you. <laughs> like, we'll wrap you up in a cozy sweater. Come on, we'll take care of you. Don't do that to yourself. I just, yeah, it was just, it was really, really hard to yeah, see. Yeah. Like you said, she is a really cool character. We love her so much already. And then it's like, no, why are you doing this? To yourself yep yeah Ugh. anyway i'm i hope we don't see any more of that <laughs> but it is in the boys universe so it's entirely possible at mm-hmm. least it's not as gross as some things i've seen if you know you know yeah yep. <laughs> all right guys uh, so that's a wrap on episode one we're going to be continuing with episode two so please subscribe click the bell icon all notifications and upvote this video and we will catch you in the next one i'm achara kirk this is michael boos ciao